Hey guys, make sure you stand to the end. One common mistake people make when replacing fuses relays that can cost you thousands of dollars in repairs. Stay with us, we'll explain what it is. Hey guys, welcome back to Auto Repair guys. Thank you guys for watching and subscribing to the channel. Today will be super helpful video to any of you guys having a Mercedes E-Class, that generation right here from year 2010 to year 2016. This is known as W212 generation. If you have one of those, if you need to find where your aromatic fuses are located, you have two of them in two different fuse boxes. Stay with us. We'll explain where you can find them, where you can buy cheap parts, tools, fuses, relays at a good price, quick shipping. That way you do not waste money and time and why it's important to always test fuses and realize all that guys will be covered absolutely free for your convenience make sure you stay until the end so before we start let us tell you a little bit about us guys now if you have a mercedes e-class that generation from year 2010 to year 2016 17 guys this is the w212 guys we're going to have a video for every single fuse relay on that car why things do not work why we're making this one because uh we're trying to save you time and money guys let's say you're down the road in the middle of nowhere your car does not start you need to find where your engine starter fuse relay is located guys where you can find fuel injection uh, system uh, fuses fuel pump fuses all you have to do come to the channel watch that video one two minutes you're back on the road guys in addition we'll share where you can buy cheap parts and tools that way you do not waste your money and time every single car we get here at the garage we try to make guys at least two to three hundred free repair videos we take them completely apart we show you how to fix mechanical electrical engine work guys bodywork a little bit of everything and we have more than 12,000 free repair videos on our channels that can save you thousands of dollars guys in free repair videos check it out if you need help with that so let's go ahead and start on it now so the aromatic fuses let's explain where you can find them we will demonstrate on this generation mercedes e-class here this is the pre-facelifted model this is the facelifted model guys but it will work for both now uh, you have multiple fuse boxes today we'll be working in two and the first one is under the hood open the hood under this cover you have a fuse box the main engine fuse box with a layout like this one here before we continue let's explain quickly guys why it's always a good idea to test fuses and relays so it is super important guys to always test fuses and relays and something else as well common mistakes people make sometimes you may think that a fuse is good or uh, uh, you cannot actually see if the fuse is clearly burned and in that case guys you may need uh, you may put the fuse back together uh, and you may end up spending money and time on parts you don't need and uh, all we had to do is just test the fuse so we'll put a link in the description of the video below how to test the fuse it takes only a few seconds to find out for sure if it's good or bad the same thing for relays guys okay uh, some of those could be really expensive on cars so we'll put a link in the description of the video below how you can test relays and for some certain fuses guys it's important to disconnect the car battery when removing them otherwise you can burn the electronics and uh, for instance working on airbags fuses or anything like that you need to wait at least one hour after disconnecting the car battery and if you're not qualified and certified to work on airbag system i will never recommend to do that guys uh, but when disconnecting the car battery guys okay common mistake people make it's important to know which battery terminal you disconnect reconnect first if you do it the wrong way you can burn electronics modules how we know about that we burn uh, before the uh, traction control module on bmw that cost is two thousand dollars guys so uh, we'll put a link in the description of the video below which battery terminal to disconnect first check it out for your convenience so the aromatic fuse where you can find it we'll have one fuse here one more in a different fuse box if you guys need to buy any fuses relays parts tools aromatic parts at a really good price quick shipping we'll put the link in the description of the video below for your convenience that way you do not waste your money and time next to every fuse you have a number that indicates that fuse and we need to check fuse number 12 that one right here okay this one now next you need to open the trunk in the trunk on the right side you have that cover open it and you'll find the main trunk fuse box layout and here we need to check another fuse guys and it's known as fuse number 68 and we're talking about this 15m fuse right here the numbers will be printed of the fuses right next to it so hopefully the video will be helpful thank you guys for watching see you next time